morning, Foley High School. I'm Bailey. And I'm Jaden. Today is December 3rd. And you're watching the Lion Pride News. Good morning, Foley High School. My name is Tasia, and I'm here with... Calvin. And today, he's going to show you where his outfit is from. All right, my outfit, you know what I mean? You know, I'm more like, you know, with icy though, so... You know, chain, uh, let's see, sweater from, let's see, online, though. You know, this thing they seen, though, you feel me? Shorts, they literally from tits I shot right in the door. Shoes, right in the door. Tits I shot all the way. Um, wristbands, you know what I mean? Just go, go crazy with it, though, on the wrist. And then I see all the way to, like I said, stop playing. Now on to Sudi on the Shelf. So guys, we're going to have a new game on campus called Sudi on the Shelf. There will be this Grinch around the, around the campus, and you will have to look for him, and he will have a QR code with him, which you can scan and gain a point for your team. This will start Monday, December 9th. You will be able to gain a total of five points total. Good luck. Now on to our spicy new segment, Hot Ones. Everybody, I'm Isaac, Coach Parker, Coach Carswell, Coach B, Coach Ayers, and we're here for this special edition of Hot Ones. Today, our sponsor is Pepper Palace, located in the Tanger Outlet in Foley. They have over 100 locations across the entire United States. They're open seven days a week, and they're very grateful for providing us with three hot sauces. Let's get started. First, we got our Hot Ones Buffalo. Our first question, how did y'all feel about that basketball game you won two weeks ago? It was a pretty dominant performance. I mean, what was the score, 27 to uh, 13? 27 yeah. to 13. I mean, dominant performance by the teachers. Um, we played as a team, and uh, the seniors maybe couldn't figure out how to do that, so we came out with the win. I can show these young guys how to play. Fat cat. What is the worst job you've ever had? Worst job I ever had was probably working at Firehouse Subs. Uh, sweeping sand off of condos, and I did mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> about 15 stories every day. And then we got trash and linen at the same time. Wendy's and when I worked for a realtor, like keeping up the properties. Um, when I was in high school, I was a soccer, like a youth soccer official, and I was terrible. Um, I think when I was around 10 years old, I mucked horse stalls for a family friend. All right, our next one, um, Pepper Palace gave us this one. It's the Black Rose hot sauce. Really good. Nice right. stuff. Mm -hmm. What's your Wait. worst um, Wait. childhood memory? Um, going boating. And for some reason, I was sitting at the front of the boat when it was being pulled on the trailer. My dad was pulling the boat, and he hit a sharp turn, and my leg got stuck in between his truck and the boat. And I started screaming, and you know, still have some scars right there from that. Almost drowning, swimming underneath something in a pool that wasn't meant to swim underneath, like a little, it's like a little turtle-looking thing. And I made it halfway underneath it, and I got stuck right here on my chest. So my mom saw it and she came running over and yanked me out through the other side and saved me. One of my worst ones was I got this really, really bad whooping this one time. Um, like I was in second grade and I think I lied, like I got a note home and so I took it to my grandma to try and finesse her, but she saw it through it and so then I had a parent conference and I kind of stuck with the lie for a while. I came clean to like 15 years old, um, but my parents said, you know what, we're gonna cover the bases. And yeah, that, that was that was a very long time and period of discipline. Well, the that was occurred. just a better hand or was it the switch, switch, oh, switch, 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 switch game. Uh, 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 yeah, that was a little, it was tough, that was tough. I was in probably third grade and I went, I was talking to a little, a little girl by the playset, and we were underneath the playset, and Probably 15 to 20 wasps came out of a nest and I got lit up all over my head and my neck and my face. That was a bad day. I'd say probably when I almost drowned, like you were saying, I was in my grandparents' pool and I was underwater for almost a minute because I could not swim up. And then I just stopped swimming and I floated up. All right, this next one is from Pepper Palace as well. It's the Fusion Garlic Hot Sauce. This one's not too bad. It tastes good though. It I, that's a good sauce. Yeah, that tastes good. good. I really like the garlic. It hasn't killed me yet. What is your favorite school subject other than the one you teach? Well, obviously PE. That was always the big one outside of social studies. So. History. I enjoyed the 
Um, <laughs> <laughs> that's all I was getting to. <laughs> I enjoyed, you know, studying the different wars through history. I want to say Spanish, but probably really English. I uh, really enjoyed English and reading and just the interpretation of literature and grammatical structure. My favorite was history. Um, like Coach B said, the wars were always interesting and learning about how we got to where we're at and, you know, I enjoyed it a lot. Excluding uh, the news class, I'd say probably history. I love learning history. And who's your current history teacher again? Gosh, I don't remember his name. <laughs> it's gone off the top of my head. not probably, probably like Coach Aaron or something. Yeah. <laughs> Some random guy. All right, well, that's all we have for the first episode for you guys. Anyone have anything else to say? Shout out Pepper Palace. That was good. That's yeah, awesome. Yeah, definitely. Thank really you all so good. much. Wishes love. Wishes love. <laughs> <Wishes luck. laughs> <laughs> You'll see us on the next one. Have a great day, Foley High, and go Lions. Go Lions. Here's more information about Toys for Tots. Hey, Foley family. Mrs. Cody here. I wanted to let you know that FTA, FCCLA, and Student Council have teamed up to work with Toys for Tots. We are asking for students to bring in um, gifts for Toys for Tots, bring them to your homeroom teacher, um, and we're gonna collect points through this as well. So just as a little extra incentive. The homeroom that brings in the most toys will actually get a free pancake breakfast. And then the top three homerooms will also get additional points um, for their LPC team. This could be multiple, team, multiple homerooms from the same team, just a little extra thing to throw out there. But the ultimate goal here is to serve kids in our community. So these toys that we are collecting will actually go back to kids here in the Foley community. Um, it doesn't have to be anything extravagant. It just needs to be new and unwrapped. So please bring in your toys to your homeroom teachers this week. The last day that we'll collect toys is December the 12th. Now let's hear from Mr. Lane. Hello, Foley High School. It's me, Mr. Lane. And if you don't know me, I'm the theater teacher here. And guess what? We're gearing up for our spring musical. Yes, our spring musical, which is a big deal around here. And this year we are doing The Music Man, which is an old school kind of show, but we're going to make it a lot of fun and a very contemporary for our uh, young audiences. And so it's a lot of fun. It's a lot of singing. It's a lot of dancing and a lot of fun comedy acting, but we need a lot of people. And I mean, it is a big, big show. We are going to have auditions on December the 13th, which is a Friday, and callbacks on December the 14th. Um, we will have an informational meeting on December the 3rd in room uh, 418, which is the choir room. I encourage you to come to the informational meeting if you are even remotely interested, because I think I might be able to convince you to come audition and try to be a part of something that I think will be a lot of fun and a wonderful memory for you to cherish for a lifetime. So come and be a part of the music, man, because it's going to be great. It's going to be wonderful. We're going to have a wonderful time. So December the 3rd, informational meeting in the choir room, auditions December the 13th, and the show performs all the way in April. So there you go. Go Lions. What's up, guys? Back here with the Locker Room Report. Congratulations to the men's and women's basketball teams on their wins over the break. Also, good luck to them tonight as they face Sarah Land at home, and the theme is good. That's all for today. Have a great day, and, and go Lions! Please stand to recite the Foley High School Creed. I am a Foley Lion. I will stand for honor, integrity, and pride. I will serve with strength and courage. I will own the path to my future. I will hold myself to a higher standard. I will strive for excellence in all I do. This is my oath. This is my pledge. I am a Foley Lion.